Try to imagine a movie featuring a positive portrayal of a Catholic parochial school starring a happy-go-lucky priest and a lovely, engaging nun that all comes together in an inspiring, Oscar-winning performance. Yeah, that must have come from way on the other side of the last century mark. But Jonathan Decker says this week's movie night must-see recommendation is the perfect example of why the 1940s is referred to as the golden age of Hollywood. Hi, everybody. Most modern film buffs know Bing Crosby from the film White Christmas and Ingrid Bergman from Casablanca, but they actually shared the screen in an Oscar-winning film called The Bells of St. Mary's. The pair star as a priest and a nun who butt heads initially and then form an unlikely friendship as they try to help a group of teenage boys. With a dynamite cast and excellent music, The Bells of St. Mary's is one to put on your list. Okay, thanks Jono. And here's a little bit of departing trivia on this movie. The Bells of St. Mary was overseen by a Catholic priest who served as an advisor during the shooting. While the final farewell sequence was being filmed, Bing Crosby and Ingrid Bergman decided to play a prank on the real priest. They asked the director to allow one more take on a scene where Father O'Malley and Sister Benedict say their last goodbyes. Instead of the appropriate farewell for a nun and a priest, they embraced in a passionate kiss, which sent the off-screen advisor priest into a near cardiac. With that one, the film could have picked up a 10th Oscar for Best Outtake. 